What is the main bomber of the United States Air Force? Some of the most legendary aircraft in the history of the United States Air Force were strategic bombers. From the earliest aircraft to his B-17 Flying Fortress and his B-25 Mitchell of World War II, every strategic bomber has earned a place in the history books. Today, in the era of unmanned aerial vehicles, long-range ballistic missiles, and versatile fighter aircraft, the role of strategic bombers is being questioned. However, the Air Force still operates more than 120 bombers, and their diverse uses are interesting to explore. Let's take a closer look at each of the three bombers operated by the United States Air Force and what role they play in the modern fleet. Boeing B-52 Stratofortress The Boeing B-52 Stratofortress has been in service since 1952 and has served as the mainstay of the U.S. Air Force's strategic bomber fleet for many years. Powered by eight turbofan engines, the aircraft is extremely robust and suitable for a wide range of missions. With a maximum takeoff weight of nearly half a million pounds, this bomber is huge and nuclear capable. Unsurprisingly, huge numbers were built, with a total of 744 planes rolling off Boeing's assembly line. Given the changing nature of modern warfare, many are beginning to question the role that traditional long-range strategic bombers play in modern air forces. Still, work is underway to modernize the B-52JS engines and technology in preparation for production, so the Pentagon is unlikely to phase out the aircraft anytime soon. Many have suggested that these modernizations could keep the B-52 in service for another century. Rockwell B-1 Lancer The aircraft had variable geometry wings and was one of the first supersonic bombers capable of carrying nuclear payloads, though it was no longer capable of carrying nuclear weapons. The jet proved to be a dynamic weapon for the Air Force and remains in service nearly 40 years after its introduction in 1986. Powered by four afterburning turbofan engines, this aircraft can reach supersonic speeds while carrying a huge payload with a maximum takeoff weight of approximately 500,000 pounds. Bombers remain an important element of the Air Force's nuclear deterrent. Of those, 104 came off the production line. Since his original B-1A prototype design was announced, three variants have appeared. The B-1B is in service, with 100 built and has a top speed of Mach 1.25. However, in 2004, there was also a proposal for the B-1R, which would be faster at Mach 2.2, but would have 20% less range. However, no B-1R units were built. Northrop Grumman B-2 Spirit The B-2 Spirit is widely considered the bomber of the future and is the most advanced of the Air Force's three active strategic bombers. Although the aircraft is not capable of supersonic flight, it is equipped with stealth technology that makes it virtually undetectable by enemy anti-aircraft systems. The B-2 Spirit is one of the most feared weapons of the U.S. military, as it is the only known aircraft in the world that can launch thermonuclear warheads in a stealth configuration. His typical B-2 arsenal includes up to 16 B-83 nuclear bombs, the most powerful weapon in the U.S. nuclear arsenal, each with a destructive force of more than 1.2 megatons. <laughs>